Hello, Brenton with All of Octane here. In this video, I'm going to open up some of the brand new 2022 Hot Wheels pop culture cars that I was able to find on the pegs. I am not into any of the Marvel stuff exactly, so the uh, the Deadpool scooter and some of the Spider-Man stuff, I just kind of left that on the pegs. And I apologize. If you guys like that stuff, I can definitely... Let me know in the comments. I can definitely try to buy it. But I'm kind of budget conscious, so I try to buy the stuff that I like. The No Time to Die of Valhalla, Asimart Valhalla concept, and the Gas Monkey are cars that I definitely do like. And so I'm actually going to open these, especially the Gas Monkey. I've never opened a premium Gas Monkey Corvette thus far. And so I'm definitely going to do that. That being said, uh, have you guys gotten your entries in? I think this video is too late at this point. The sweepstakes will be over, but he, the Gas Monkey, uh, Richard Rawlings, does uh is doing giveaways or he's been he's done one giveaway now he's doing two and i've definitely entered i bought merch to try to enter to try to win some of the cars because you know why not we've seen somebody win before which means somebody can win again and hopefully it's me and that would be really cool and i definitely bring you guys along for the ride Man, the base on this thing is gold. That is really cool. I believe this is the Midas Monkey. I think that's what they call it. It's a 68 Gas Monkey Garage. 68 Corvette Gas Monkey Garage. I think that's what they're just calling it. Uh, but I believe they've they've nicknamed it the Midas Monkey. I don't think it says anywhere here on the back. But that is kind of the problem with the car cultures too, is on the back, they don't show you which cars are part of the set. You just got to kind of find them. But again, this is my first premium opened gas monkey corvette i'm glad to do so um if i get a chance to win if i win the sweepstakes i'll definitely take one of my carded ones of these uh one maybe one of the older versions and have him sign that potentially that would be awesome this casting looks like it's already taken quite a beating it's got a uh, bunch of kind of flushing there it's pretty rough but then again it looks like it came out of 1968 which is pretty cool. So like the rear or the red rim tires, five spoke kind of torque thrust wheels, gas monkey logo all over. Again, not a bad thing and big back tires. Yeah, this thing is really cool. Really nice to add a loose one to the collection for sure. It's finally probably gonna go in one of my cases. That way I can have an unboxing for you guys. All right, next up is going to be the No Time to Die Aston Martin Valhalla concept. Now, I was debating whether I wanted to open this, and I actually had debated too, as you guys, if you saw one of my old videos of opening up this one as well. So we're gonna actually open up this one too. We're gonna open up both of them, um, just because I, uh, do I want to? It's just such a cool set though. Like, man, that they look so cool in the box. Hmm, hmm. That's a tough decision. Maybe you guys can let me know. Let me know in the comments. Do I open them or do I not open them? That's just such a cool thing. They match and I could display them this way because they display better looking this way. Maybe I'll hold off on that. I think I'll hold off still on opening both of these even though the Valhalla is awesome. So let's take a look at it through the package. Nice rims on this thing. Kind of has like a grayish, silverish, yellow. There's like a little hint of yellow in there. It's like a cream almost. Ah, it's got a really cool kind of matte top. Not even matte. It looks like a, should be like a carbon. Tampos in the rear. Yep. White tampos in the rear. Kind of has that uh, Valkyrie rear taillights. There's the front of it. Yeah, that thing is really, really cool. I'm glad I've at least gotten to open one of these in one of the sets, the exotic sets. But yeah, I think I'm just going to keep this in the package for the moment and then display these two as is because I didn't buy multiples of them. So there you have it. There is at least the Gas Monkey opened up. There is the No Time to Die Aston Martin Valhalla concept, part of the same set that you could get those two in. And then, like I said, I had the No Time to Die Aston Martin still laying around because I was still waiting for this one to come out so I could either unbox them or display them. And I think I might just display them. It was such a cool movie. No spoilers in the comments below if you spoil the, the James Bond movie. Uh, but it was a great movie. 
probably one of the best ones by far and it'll be nice to see where they go from it from there. So let me know in the comments below what you think and until the next one, have a good one.